Hey YouTubers, all the fans of Zeus and Bella. We're here with some uh, uh, shoppers. And uh, we have, what's your name? Hunter. Hunter. Yeah. He's looking for a Doberman puppy for our future litter from Zeus and Bella. There they are. And um, what is it that you're looking in a puppy? What are you um, looking to get? I really want a black and rust female. That's like my ultimate goal. Oh, you want a black and rust female? Yeah. Cool. That's, that's what I really want. Uh huh. I think they're very beautiful. What is it that, um, like, you you watched some of the videos and stuff on yeah. Zeus and Bella? What was it that was uh, interesting or cool about these particular dogs that you liked? And why is it that you would like a puppy from? From this sire and this, pardon me. They're super athletic, uh -huh. and I know they're very loyal. Um, just watching them, I love dogs that love and know how to play. I love playing with my dogs at home, so I know it's going to be fun to play with one of them. Yeah, yeah. definitely. Cool. Cool. There's Zeus and Bella. Trying to get lots of attention. They're attention, little attention for us. Yeah, they are. <laughs> it's okay though. Yeah. Because they're very cute. So if there's any questions for me, ask me, and then I'm sure the viewers probably, oh, you're okay to for me to film you, right? Yes, of course. Okay, cool, of thank course. you. <clears throat> uh, if there's any questions that you wanted to ask, uh, it might serve as uh, answers for other YouTubers that are uh, wondering the same questions. I don't know. What were you expecting to find uh, by meeting them? Um, I just wanted to really make sure that this is what I wanted because I've only met one, like my stepdad was talking about one of his friends. Mm -hmm. one. I mean, I fell in love instantly with that one, and I uh -huh. knew that I'd have to get one. So, yeah. Yeah. Which, uh, I assume you watched multiple videos. Which video yeah, did you like? I watched the one of them running after the birds. Um, the one of him learning how to open the gate. That one was really cool. <laughs> That, that one's so cool. I thought that was funny. I showed my mom that. She's like, yeah. wow. Yeah, they're very smart. It's insane. Yeah, extremely intelligent. It's crazy how, how, how smart dogs really are. Like, once you get to know a dog like this, you're like, they're insanely intelligent. Uh-huh. <laughs> Why you can't you roll back to me? <laughs> Making a video, come back. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, that's just their natural being. They want attention from everybody. Zeus, just go jump in my truck and you can go home with me. <laughs> There'll be no more Zeus and Bella. <laughs> Good boy. Okay. <clears throat> Very cool. Love these dogs. How do you like the property? You like the their yeah. living quarters. Yeah. Have you seen their living quarters? Is it back there no, no, it's it's oh, over it's here. Over here in the front. They have a hundred square foot home right there. It's air conditioned. Oh, that's <laughs> I, originally, when I made it, I uh, I made two uh, two uh, compartments, one for him and one for her, which was slightly larger once she had the puppies. But it didn't end up working that way because once they have puppies, they <laughs> she doesn't she doesn't want them anywhere close, and he doesn't want to be close to the puppies. <laughs> he, yeah. I mean, he does, but as soon as she expresses That's her, his business. yeah, as soon as she expresses that no, no, you you don't belong here, then then uh, he kind of stays away. She and did. it's really interesting to watch them because she'll come out after you know. Usually she's like when she's with her puppies, she oh nice you sneezed right here. <laughs> All over the ground. Uh, usually when when she's with her uh, puppies, she doesn't come out at all for the first probably about a week. She'll mm -hmm. come out real quick to get a drink or to eat, 
if the food is fairly nearby and that's about it, then, then she, she goes right back to the puppies. But after that, she'll come out and play and run a little bit, like in their second week maybe. And when they're, <clears throat> when, when she comes out, they're playing, they're running around with each other and she's perfectly fine with him. But as soon as he gets anywhere near the puppies, she shows him his teeth, she, she shows him her teeth. Like, Those are my puppies. Back yeah, now. don't get close, I'm the protector. And then he just knows to respect that space. You said you, you give them off at eight weeks, correct? Yeah, so generally speaking, uh, about uh, eight weeks is when they're already weaned off of mama's milk. But sometimes a little bit earlier, you know. But I want to make sure that I get the vet to check them out and the, uh, uh, you know, they have their well check and they have the um, vaccines up to date and okay. de they're dewormed. Of course, as I said before, their tails are docked, their dew claws are removed. You guys do the cropping or no? No, the cropping generally takes place after they leave because of the timing. There's a window that you have to do it in. I see. Yeah. Very beautiful. She's like that, that color I want, that really dark roast. Mm -hmm. That's the one I really want. It just all shines across your bones. Yeah. I usually have uh, a small uh, one or two uh, of the red bones, and then the rest are usually black and rust. So those are more rare. Those usually cost more okay. to rehome. Okay, guys.